This is Andrea Dresdale with ABC News Radio, and today we're speaking with Lorenzo and Shane Lamas. They've got a new TV show called Leave It to Lamas on E. Welcome, you guys. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Um, why is this the right time for you guys to kind of come together and do this show? Why is the right time for you to kind of have your family, you know, out there for public viewing? Examined at close scrutiny. I think that we, um, we were approached as a family and... You know, we've been approached many times, actually, and this is actually the first time that we kind of um, thought that it might be an idea that we could possibly do it. And I think that um, just bringing our family together, doing this project has really brought us all together. Um, as awkward and weird as that might sound, you know, you hear that reality shows rip families apart. Well, this actually brought our family together. Um, so that was that was pr pretty much the dynamic on why we all decided to sign on and do it. I think also the timing was good because Shane had done a um, season of The Bachelor, and I think she was still fresh in the minds of the public. So uh, Mike Flies, who produces The Bachelor, actually produces this show, and he felt that the timing might be perfect, actually. And... I, as I believe, we all kind of came in at different stages yeah, along absolutely. the way. I always supported her doing her own show because she has such a natural comedic um, quality. And when Mike Flies told me that he was shopping a show around with Shane, I was like totally behind 100% because I think she's a natural, funny, talented, you know, sweet personality. Uh, and she's my daughter. <laughs> I, I might <laughs> so be a little not, biased, yeah. biased, a little bit. <laughs> uh, but then, then, then you know, then her sister Dakota came aboard. Then her mom came aboard, and and AJ. Yeah, her, we actually were you know, all on board except Dad over here was the last to get on board, and we kind of were all on board. And then my dad was not going to do the show. You well, know? I, I had other things that may have conflicted schedule wise with the show at first and then I was able to work everything out and uh, you know I I'm doing the show for her well it was so you know. then it wasn't actually the concept of the show that was putting you up it was strictly a schedule it was problem. really scheduling I had other I had two other shows that I was weighing you know in terms of what I'd be participating in and, and it just my my love for her and the desire for her to have a platform to show her talents far outweighed anything and that plus, I had And plus, having on. Lorenzo Lamas on your show will sell your show, <laughs> hands down. Yeah, but well, I didn't look at it. I just, I'm looking at it like a dad would look at something to do to help his, his kids. You yeah. Know? Well, Shane, I, I would have thought that perhaps you would have had your fill of reality after the experience on the I back. have, <laughs> yes, absolutely. I'm, I can't believe I'm still on this train. But this is a different, different project. I mean, this is family. You know, we're working together as a family. We're all supporting each other, and um, it's not, it doesn't really feel like work because it's, you know, you're working in this project with your family. Um, it's, you know, I, I won't be going on Amazing Race or anything like that. Um, never say never. Yeah, <laughs> right, I won't. <laughs> I'd like to see her on Dancing it. with the Stars. <laughs> you know, I'm that would be great. I'm actually you know, surprised that, that you've never been on Dancing it, with the it's Stars. It's not my bag, really? you know, honestly, it's just not my thing. But she would be great on that show. Well, you never know. What, I mean, as we've seen with reality shows, it always seems like one leads right. to another. You are now Absolutely. living proof of that. But I, I think that, um, you know, we're a house of actors, and that's, you know, our day job, and that's what we do, and that's what we do to put food on our table. And this is just a project that was fun, and we all kind of signed on, and it's became this amazing thing in our lives now because of what it has done to our family and brought everyone closer. And, um, you know, but at the end of the day when this is uh, – you know, how whatever happens with this show, um, forever how long it's on or just one season, you know, we'll go back to what we know how to do and that's act. So what will people learn about the Lamas family by watching this show and what do you hope they get out of it? I think that uh, I can't wait for my dad's fans to actually see who my father really is. He has this stereotype out there of, you know, been divorced, you know, career up and downs when really he is just a family man, a humble man, a good guy, monotone, not crazy, not what the, you know, the public perceives him to be. And I think that that is, is going to be awesome 
for for his fans and viewers to see and just to get the the overall feeling love of our family and we hope that you know our viewers will relate and um, yeah i think that the the common denominator in our family is heart yeah and and we have fun you know we have our differences i have things to work out with my son you know and and uh but but beneath it all you know all of the the show is is the fact that we really care about each other yeah like we're not fighting for camera time or we're not jealous of this person's you know what they have going on and you know let me get into this scene type of thing it's it there you will see that there is nothing like that in our family you know and it's all about just all of us being and supporting each other and what's going on good bad beautiful ugly career um, and the love and it's not really you know to 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 get us our names out there I mean, it's to, been fun honestly you know, I mean fun, yeah. I've seen more of my kids doing I, the I'm show sure, than yeah. I have in the last three years of our life you know the show is called leave it to llamas it's on E it starts on October 11th uh, so tune in we'll be watching and for ABC News Radio and ABCNewsRadio.com I'm Andrea Dresdale